What's up, y'all? Oh my god, look at the lighting! <laughs> look at the lighting, oh my god, y'all. The motherfucking views behind me. Hold up. This is my first day in the apartment. I see people on YouTube, they make videos. Um, they basically make videos of them. What can I say? They basically make videos of their first night in their apartment. So I just literally just moved in here. It's nothing in here but my suitcases, got my clothes and all that shit in it. Um, hair stuff, all that stuff over there. I just bought this blow up bed. Another suitcase full of clothes, another bag, all this stuff I got put together. Um, but basically, uh, yeah, I've been sitting here and I've been on the phone because I had to FaceTime all my family members to tell them that I got my, I got into the apartment today. Um, that I moved in today. I was calling all my friends and I was just on Instagram. And I honestly just peacefully just been sitting right here on the floor, like just, I feel peaceful, like it's over like I, i'm not stressing about y'all looking for an apartment and going through all the shit that you have to go through just to get an apartment is stressful as fuck like i've been crying all month like i just and me just looking at myself not knowing what to do it was so much shit going wrong it was oh uh, yeah oh my god but i'm finally where i want to be and I feel fucking good. Um, I got me a blow up bed. I still gotta go home to go get the rest of some of my furniture and I gotta still get furniture. So we gonna be looking it out for like a cool or a couple, couple, couple of days real quick. But um, what I'm gonna do is, oh yeah, my head changed. Uh, I'm trying to try something different. Um, I couldn't get the the pink, the red out. As, I tried to get the red out as much as possible. So it's still a little bit of pink. It has to grow on me. I'm trying to try something different, whatever. Um, other than that, bitch, I'm in my apartment. I'm about to run to the store. Like, everything is literally where my building is at. So, that's the good part. The convenience is very, very good. I'm in Buckhead. So, everything is in Buckhead, y'all. Like, so, I'm going to run to the store, get, like, some shower curtains, um, some dish, some, uh, detergent, all that type of shit. Because I got to wash clothes and all of that. <laughs> I'm excited. I got a package. Let's open up this package. Y'all, I got to find my tripod. Like, everything is packed up right now. So, it's like, I don't know what nothing is at. But, I got a package. It's a bathing suit. Um, I'm about to fuck the grandma on these holes. You already know. It's a cute little Chanel box. Um, it's not real Chanel, but y'all know, like, I support black businesses, and this girl from Atlanta had a boutique, and she still, like, replica, um, bathing suits, designer bathing suits, because, of course, bitch, I don't got money for real Chanel, so, uh, yeah, we're we gonna get there, though, so I'm keeping it real with y'all, so these are the underwear, and this is the bra, shout out to her. And I believe she got these made or whatever it is, but it's bomb and shit. I'm supporting black businesses. I'm staying at my price range, bitch. You want me to have real Chanel, buy me real Chanel, period. Um, so <laughs> shout out to her. Um, it's cute though, um, it's a bathing suit. It's not like I got some fake Chanel shoes on or a fake Chanel purse, I would never do that. But it's cute, just like cool little one with nice little photo shoes, go fuck the gram up. Don't nobody know that my hair is blonde right now and I think that black with the blonde is gonna hit. I know the photographer that I'm trying to work with, he been waiting on me and I've been bullshitting. But it's been so much going on and bitch, I'm finally settled in, so bitch, I'm about to fuck the gram up. I got so many fucking outfits. I got outfits from when I went up fucking Miami that I didn't even wear. Because it's just been, it's just been so much going on. But, I'm about to fuck the gram up. How about I really want to? We about to see what the hell this blow up bed do. Now, I was gonna get, what I should have did was just get the real, real big one, y'all. I got a twin size one. I'm probably about to take this back. I still got the receipt. I'm probably about to go switch it out for the real, real big one. But the real, real big one was like $200. And they didn't have full size. All the full size was sold out. So if I get a real big one, it's not gonna sit up tall. And I'm not about to pay $200 for something that I'm only gonna use for like a little second. I'm about to get a bed, so. 
I'll just keep this one. We just gonna keep this one. It's only me. It ain't like a nigga about to be pumping my shit when it's like, you know what I mean? But yeah, it's just me. So just for like a second until my bed, my mattress and all of that stuff get here. So yeah, that's cool. All right, so then whatever, we about to open this up. So let's see what it do. They say it's supposed to blow up by itself. Cause I was like, I ain't getting no damn, uh, what you call it? The thing that blew it up. Hold up. Let me do it. Let me put it right here. Put it we got the space to do it. But I'm staying down real quick for like this week and shit until I get everything else in. Um, so yeah, I got blow up bed. Y'all right now. Make myself comfortable. I need to be uncomfortable. What the fuck would I get a big one and then think like, oh, I'm gonna no. So, just in the shit I gotta get, so. This type of shit is major hate All right, look at this, y'all. It blow itself up. This better get real tall. So I guess it's blowing itself up. That's small as shit, y'all. I don't know about that. I might gotta take that back. I ain't gonna be able to do it. I'm too big for that. What y'all think? I don't know. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna wait till it get bigger. It's growing, y'all. I mean, I don't know. I look at it like it's not gonna be right here that long. Do I need to go get a bigger one? Or like just stuck it out on this one. I always can keep this one though, like for when people come over and shit. Or like, I mean, I'm gonna have a couch and shit by then, but shit. I mean, shit, I don't know. Once it start getting taller, it look like it's doable, I guess. I don't know. Y'all, it's an hour later. My ass still laying right here, y'all. I'm just so exhausted. I feel like I, I haven't been getting no sleep all this week, for real, for real. Just stressing about apartment shit and all the rest of everything just that was just going on. And my body just feel like finally the stress is gone. Like, I feel like my body is just like relieved of stress. Like I'm exhausted, I just wanna go to sleep. It's seven o'clock, I just said I need to run, go get like, like I wanna get out the house a little bit. I don't know if I wanna just chill in here, just take a nap, but stores and shit is about to close. So I do wanna run to the store. I need to get a shower curtain and some little shit like that. I'm just tired as fuck, but I'm about to get up. I'm about to run to the store, get like a couple, little bit more shit that I need, and then, yeah. Finally about to be seeing what grandma be talking about. We should be like, turn them lights off. Y'all not paying no electric. Now I'm about to be like, I make sure I take stuff out the walls and stuff now, and um, all of that. Get some night lights. Yeah, I will, something. Night Cause I was like, I was literally just saying that. So I literally just thought of you when I took the stuff out the wall. <laughs> Hello? I'm losing signal. I'm trying my best to vlog the best way I fucking can. I'm walking over here, bitch. Trying to see all the furniture stores is over here too, so that's real good. But um, I'm walking over here. I need to get me a shower curtain, some soap. Cause I left my fucking soap uh, at the Airbnb that I was at. Um, damn, everything over here, bitch. The grocery store right the fuck here. That's what I'm fuck. I'm talking about. I'm trying to figure out where I want to go first. I was trying to go in. It's hot as hell, y'all. I'm trying to vlog the best way I can. Look at the view, y'all. It's bombed down. Buckhead is the place to be, bitch. Period. Y'all, I was on a rooftop running my mouth on the phone and shit, but y'all, it's getting dark outside. And it's so cute when it's dark, y'all, look. It's a vibe like shit. I really, really love it. Like, not trying to be funny, y'all, but just picture your bed. This is not a real bed. But picture your bed up against the window, y'all, and you having sex right here, bitch. I'm gonna be like, throw me out the windows. <laughs> 
Y'all, this a vibe like shit. I'm telling you, it's, it's no way. Like, this is like, I'm finally here with the fuck I deserve. Like, I ain't come out here on no, on no basic shit. Like, I'm really just about to live a luxury lifestyle. And I did it all by my fucking self. Like, with my own money. I work hard as shit. Like, I can't believe this shit. Like, oh my fucking God. Like, it's just so, it's, it's all fucking believable, y'all. It's so fucking unbelievable. I, I don't feel like this is my home. It feel like I'm dreaming. Like, I'm gonna wake back up and I'm gonna be back on my son in DC. Around motherfucking, I ain't gonna say the hood, but. I fucking did it, y'all. Like, I know my mother is fucking screaming right now. Like. Ma, I did it, like. <laughs> this shit is really big to me, y'all. It's just like, I don't, it's a lot. I just keep thinking about my mother like, every step of the way. Like, the fact that she's not here to, I, like, I know she sees it, she's watching me. She, she's with me and she in here right now, <laughs> probably. Like, but it's just like, I just know she proud. And I be, I be wishing like, damn, I, I wish she was here to, I could see her reaction like, I did it, my like, but she knew it was gonna happen. So, at the end of the day, it's like, damn, it's, it's really happening though, and she not here. It's just like, it's, it's, it's a crazy feeling, but I'm just, I feel good, like I did this shit by myself. Like, bitch, this is what I wake up to every fucking day. This is what I go to sleep to. This is my view. Like, I have a rooftop. I don't gotta go nowhere to look sweet, bitch. Everything is here. I can shoot videos in this motherfucker on the rooftop if I want to, in the pool. I can do whatever the fuck I wanna do. Like, I don't have, it's not forced. It's not forced no more. I can literally just flow and be Shelly the MC. I can do my YouTube videos now. I can take pictures. I can have lighting. I don't have to worry about shit anymore. Like, it's, it's crazy. Like, I feel like I got signed or something. Like, bitch, I'm still independent. Don't think, oh, because I'm in these bills. Oh, she must have got signed. No, bitch, just off straight hustle. Ain't no label putting no money behind me. Ain't nobody putting no money behind me. I've been working my fucking ass off. Stocking my bread. Planning and executing. Finding different sources of income. Like, this, this ain't no bullshit. I ain't selling no ass, I ain't selling no pussy, I ain't scamming, ain't shit going on. I do not get no motherfucking unemployment. This is straight motherfucking hustle. And I'm proud of it. And my mama, like, y'all don't understand. Like, I, my mother, like, this shit is fucking unbelievable. Like, I come from the fucking struggle, bruh. Like, I come from the fucking struggle, bruh. Like, it's sad and shit, it make me wanna cry. Like, I'm finally breaking the fucking curse in my family, like. I fucking did it. I did it today. Like, I live in a fucking luxury building. It's never gonna get better than this. It's gonna get better than this, but nothing I have ever did can top this. This is my milestone. This is the icing on the fucking cake. Like, it's, it's go time now. I know my mother, like, but, like, bitch, you did it. Like, you fucking did it. I did it by myself. Like, I had so much support from everybody, though. But money-wise, I made this money on my own with no help. But all my family and all my friends have been supporting the fuck out of me. Mentally, there for me, on the phone with me, crying, all types of shit. Like, no bullshit. All my friends, and I just tell her, I call them every day, like, thank y'all so much. I don't know how the fuck I could do this shit. Like, I was stressing myself the fuck out trying to figure this shit out. And I really fucking did it. Like, I know my family already, like, like, she's serious, she really did it. And, like, little do y'all know, by this time next year, my family will be living out here. And that's just done on that. I'm going to have a whole house for them. That's what I'm doing, because I don't want to be out here by myself. But they're going to be out here. I can't put a date on it. I'm going to just say, before, by this time next year, they're going to be out here. That's just done on that. And... <sighs> It's really turning nighttime, and the fact that it's not gonna get dark because these buildings light up is very cute.
I'm just, I feel good. I'm very, very tired. I'm not, I don't have no appetite. My body is just like, I want to relax. I couldn't find no shower curtain, so I'm just going to take a bath tonight. And um, I'm going to take a bath, like a bubble bath, and just sit back and relax. I'll probably go get some wine. Um, yeah. Sit back and relax and just enjoy the night. And when I wake up in the morning, I'm gonna watch the motherfucking sunrise. The sun should be coming up right there. So I'm gonna set my alarm to at least like seven. My body wake up at seven o'clock every morning anyway. So the fact that I can wake up to that is a dream come true. I'm really waking up to views and everybody, it, like views and watching the sunset and the sunrise and just watching it, it just give me pe a peace of mind. Like I can, I feel like my dreams is all the way out there and I'm just watching it. Like, I don't know, I just, I never felt like this in my life. I finally feel satisfied. I finally feel like I'm around what I'm, I have what I, what's worth of me having. Like I'm not settling, I'm not around no bullshit. I'm not around no, the wrong motherfuckers. I'm not around no drama. Like it's, it's me and I'm, I'm about to hustle like shit. I'm about to hustle my ass off, I'm about to record this shit and I'm about to give it to y'all. And that's just that one that like, period. I don't know how long this vlog gonna be. I just, I'm just, I'm just recording so just, you know, be with me. I love y'all. Thank every, thank y'all, everybody just been supporting it. And I think that's the end of this vlog. Cause it's dark in here, but it looks like it's light because the lighting is still, that's the good part. It's no lights on and it's pitch black, but this camera just pick up a lot of light. So the camera make it look like it's light in here, but it's dark and shit. So. <sighs> good night. This is the first night. I'm gonna still record probably when I wake up. I don't know. Bye, y'all. <laughs>